Here's a very handy technique from the clinch. Uh, so you're, you're grabbing on pretty tight. You're probably in a 50-50 clinch. So you're grabbing on tight in the bag. To distract your opponent and to hurt your opponent, you can throw an uppercut in, you can throw a hammer fist into their thighs. You can even do a knee off either leg or inward knee, it doesn't matter. But you're kind of trying to take your opponent's mind away from, from what you're gonna do up here. And you wanna make them concentrate on, on lower down. So good, a few hard shots. Next thing I'm gonna do is step across with my front leg so the side that my head is on if you're in a square stance that's cool but the side that your head is on is the leg that I'm going to step across so I'm stepping with my front leg inside and I turn around elbow right into the face so I've got my clinch I'm doing all my work here downstairs I step across with my fr front leg elbow right into the bag so if they're pushing against you, which they more than likely will when you're in a clinch, they'll be pushing back against you as well and driving forward, it'll make this even more effective. So work your uppercut, your hammers, work your knees, bide your time, wait for it, step an elbow right into the, into the face. So you can work on this in the bag or in the air, just be careful if you're practicing with your opponent. If they don't know what's coming, it's a, it's a very, very effective strike. Best luck with that.